As communities in southern Arizona grow, our natural desert landscape is replaced with new developments. But there's still hope for native plants thanks to a group of dedicated local volunteers. Nine on your side's Megan Meyer shows us how they're saving some of the desert's most precious gems. Okay, lay ho. One, two, three. three. It took the strength of seven men to hoist this thousand pound barrel cactus into the trunk of a pickup. It's headed off to a better home after growing here in the desert for decades. When I see the numbers of almost 124,000 plants that we've saved. This Sunday in Vail, the Tucson Cactus and Succulent Society added dozens more to that list. We're looking at the little plants, the plants that are overlooked and, and taken maybe sometimes 100 years to grow and we save those. The group is made up of thousands of volunteers with a passion for preserving plants. They travel around southern Arizona, finding spots where development is coming, acquire permits and save plants before it's too late. We were originally notified by the developer, um, Diamond Ventures, so we started our rescues about three or four years ago. The plants are most commonly taken to Pima Prickly Park, a seven acre public desert. Others go off to individual homes. This is a very special place. The folks in Tucson want to keep it a special place, want to preserve the heritage of the Sonoran Desert. And helping out is as simple as picking up a shovel. You're not going to stop growth. Let's try to do it in the best possible way. See that? We did it. Megan Meyer, Kagan 9 on your side.